Hey guys, welcome to your um, love reading for Leo. This is going to be for your May 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look at the person that you're thinking of dealing with. We're going to see what's, what's on this person's mind. And then we'll finish off the read to see uh, what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, um, you know, outcome. Uh, so apply this to your own unique situations. You may switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Uh, if this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Leo people. Not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below to support me on there too. So tell me about um, tell me about uh, Leo. What is going on with Leo? What is going on with Leo in love? The person that they are thinking of and dealing with. What is this person's? Uh, what's on this person's mind when it comes to Leo? When it comes to Leo for May twenty twenty four, Sun Moon Rising, Venus signs. We have Temperance here. Five of Cups, Temperance, Sagittarius, Energy, Five of Cups, Three of Cups, Four of Swords, King of Swords. I feel like this person wants to talk to you and get together here with you. I do feel like they regret something that they did here. I'm not quite sure what they did, but this person's in some sort of deep regret. And they're looking for your forgiveness. They're looking to regain your trust here, okay? Yeah, I, I feel like there was an ending here. Be uh, it seems like this person had options, okay? It seems like this person might have made a bad decision here. And I feel like this person wants to come in and correct what they did here. The two of wands and the five of cups, the death card and the temperance card, okay? So I feel like I'm getting a bit of a reconciliation energy here and a separation here, okay? The uh, three of cups and the eight of pentacles. Whoever this is, I do feel like this is an individual that wants to work things out here. I mean, this is a, it doesn't have to be someone that you've been dealing with for a long time. It could be, you know, someone newer that's coming into your life that you've met in the last three or six months or something like that. Tell me the Four of Swords. You could also apply this to, like, a new person, an ex, a current person, the Four of Swords, Nine of Pentacles here. So, Leo, I feel like this is you. If you have been in no contact with this person here, I feel like you guys are about to sit down and have the meeting of the minds here and hash things out and talk about things here, okay? There is going to be a conversation that's going to happen here. The uh, King of Swords. You know, in this conversation, I feel like it's important for you guys to be intentional about what you want to accomplish in this conversation here, okay? I do feel like the person that's coming in with an apology here, their ego's a bit bruised because I feel like you left them behind here. And I feel like this person might complain about it, you know? But, you know, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like this person doesn't really have that capacity to allow you that safe space to express yourself because when you, you know, express how you feel, this person feels like you're complaining. Okay, so we have this, uh, 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 the uh, King of Pentacles here and the Two of Pentacles. Yeah. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? Ten of Pentacles. This person wants to be with you again. And they feel like this person's willing to juggle knives to make this happen. Yeah, they're willing to juggle knives to make this happen. What else do we have for, for Leo? What else does Leo need to know? Look out for work on outcome for Leo. For Leo. Five of Pentacles. Seems like this person's lonely without you here. They're wanting a new beginning here with the Ace of Pentacles here. They're wanting prosperity, commitment here with the Eight of Cups. 
with a page of swords. It seems like you're turning your back on this individual here. Yeah. I feel like the conversation is not going to go so well, if anything. Yeah, I, I feel like in this situation with this individual that you're dealing with here, I just feel like there's a lack of listening here, you know? I just feel like something here, I, I just feel like things are not really being understood, you know? And I feel like another thing is that someone here keeps getting defensive, so things are not really going anywhere, okay? So uh, we have the Three of Swords and the Six of Cups. You know, I feel like this person misses you a lot. This person's brokenhearted that, you know, you know, whatever attempt that they're trying to do to bring this back together, it's not working. You know, if they feel like they're doing everything wrong, they're also kind of like playing the victim here, you know. So, you know, I do feel like, you know, there is a bit of an imbalance between you and this person here. Uh, it seems like there's a bit of an immaturity here too, or insecurity here. The Five of Pentacles, why is the Five of Pentacles here? And the Three of Wands. Let's talk about the Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, and the Six of Wands. They're hoping to have success and victory here for you. They're hoping that you will come back to you, you know, if you do reject them. Yeah, I just feel like there's a conversation that's going to happen here. Leo, I feel like really, it's not really going to go over very well. Yeah, it's going to lead you to reclaim your power here. Stand up for yourself let them go, and move on. They really missed what they had here with you. They're trying everything that they can to win you back. There is a fear of losing you here. I mean, you could be cutting out a karmic here. Yeah, you could be actively using that sword, making a decision, and just cutting someone out. Ace of Swords here. Yeah, you're to totally done with this. I pre I'm pretty sure that... You're pretty clear about the decision that you made here, okay? And, you know, I, I just feel like the, this decision that you made for yourself, this is something that, that might have taken some time to do that, but I feel like you're not going back here, Leo. What else do we have here for Leo? The Hierophant, Taurus Energy. Yeah, I feel like more so you're trying to do right by yourself here, and the Ten of Wands here, you're totally releasing this here, and you're making a decision to move on from this, because I feel like the decision that you made is a decision that you're happy with and I feel like you're moving towards your happiness or that you're reclaiming your happiness or that you're reclaiming your freedom here. All right, so Leo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys, bye.